Can I help you? Can I help you? Yeah, I, I see that. I was on my way up here to this flying shape, which I'm at right now. But I came here last night and I looked around and noticed that, you know, it was super tight, super crowded. Everybody was in for the night. So I was like, man, bump it. I realized that I passed up a Sam's Club, which was down the street. So I said, let me go ahead and uh, jump in this Sam's Club parking lot. So let me tell you guys what happened last night when I pulled up in the Sam's Club. So. I'm rolling, I'm pulling up in the Sam's Club and I get finished for the night. You know, I, I just, you know, spend a couple of minutes before, you know, I, I shut everything down. You know, I look around, check out my surroundings and stuff like that. Well, in this instances, I happen to notice a dude over in the cut and I'm looking at him like, hmm. You know, it's like three other trucks here in the parking lot with me, it's like, it's like two other trucks that's in front of me and one truck is on the side of me. So, you know, I'm over here peeping them out, peeping them out, peeping them out. And it's always good to do a post trip. Now, depend on where you at to do a post trip, you know, you all, you know, safety is always a factor when, you know, you do post trips in areas that you're not familiar with. But in this instance, I noticed the dude over here, you know, just eyeballing the trucks. And I and I don't understand why. I'm like looking at him like, what's, what's this cat doing? What's this cat doing? So, you know, I'm over here peeping him. I'm, I'm eyeballing him. You know, he walks from the where the little gas station area is over to uh, over to the truck that's in front of me. And I don't know what he was doing, like writing shit down or talk, telling somebody. I thought, I thought he was like one of them boot dudes, you know what I'm saying, that was hiding in the cut. All are uh, awake, I doubt anybody is. But I'm down here in uh, Kentucky and I have just was booted, literally, um, by a R and R parking enforcement. There's five other trucks here, and there's one. They booted him. It's on the windshield. They booted him, and well, that's a trainer. They booted him, and it's $500, or you get towed. You have one hour to pay it. Unless you can show a receipt that you shopped in Walmart within an hour. So that's why I was like, all right, well, I'm ready for this. You know what I'm saying? You know, if I see him coming, I could just go on ahead and pull up and pull the, you know, pull up out of here. I'm not, I ain't got time for no boot and I ain't got time for, I ain't got time for none of that. You know? Ain't nobody got time for that. You know what I'm saying? But he was just, you know, doing whatever. So he walks to the back of my truck and, you know, I'm looking in the mirrors and I noticed that he didn't come from behind my truck. So I get out of my truck, I grab my, I get out of my truck, I grab my knife and my little, my little mat, uh, my little, you know, I got the mat like, you know, the police kind that you can knock a, knock a head off with, you know what I'm saying? So I go back there, I go back there and I put my GoPro on, I go back there, dude standing behind my truck like I don't know what he was doing like writing down numbers or whatever the whatever he was doing so I walk up to him and I go yo bro can I help you Can I help you, bruh? 
Can I help you, man? Can I help you? I'm like, yo, can I, can I help you? So, you know, he got, he jumped, like, like literally, the look like, look like the Holy Ghost just came up out this bruh. So, he looked at me, and he starts to walk it. And I go, you know, I'm over here, like, maybe about two, three steps behind him, and I'm going like, yo, bro, can I help you? Whatever, you know what I'm saying? What you doing? So then, you know, he goes into, like, like maniac mode, like, ah, and I'm over here hollering too, like, ah. Can I help you? Can I help you? Yeah, I, I see that. So I was like, look, man, I ain't got time for this crazy shit. So, you know, I walk, you know, he was walking and he walked in front of Sam's Club and he knocked down the little, the little signboard or whatever. And he, you know, he walked right, you know, like, like slow walking in the parking lot. Dude, I tell you, I did not get back in my truck until he literally like walked like all the way up here by this, uh, by the bridge and that was it. Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm right here, bro. I I'm I'm still right here, waiting to help you. I was like, yo, we just gave him some help. Bust his fucking ass. And shit. I bet you he won't come over here and disrespect like that again. Man, listen, y'all. I had to sleep with one eye open last night for real, because like I said, I ain't had time. For no BS. Ain't nobody got time for that. For no garbage. Ain't nobody got time for that. None of that last night. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody got time for that. Man, you know, whenever you guys get into an area that you're not familiar with, you know, like I said, safety is always a factor. Definitely beware of your surroundings. And this goes to you two ladies. Beware of your surroundings because like I said, I don't know what that dude was doing behind my trailer He could have been he could have been pissing he could have been he, he could have been trying to sabotage my shit I don't know Can I help you bro? Can I help you man? I don't know but I had to get out and just be like yo bro. What you doing? You know what I'm saying? So Yeah, that was last night. I mean <laughs> Yo, y'all, react to me. What do you guys think? You know, what do you guys think of, of that situation? What would you have done in that situation? You know what I'm saying? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, man, if you guys like videos like this and like me popping up on your feed, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit that bell. Make sure you give me some coffee. I need some coffee for this one. Yo, hook me up with some coffee. I'm right here at the J. Right here. I'm at the J. Hook a brother up with some coffee, man. So, so yeah, get at your boy. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.